Who doesn't love John Cena? I mean, he is one of the most adorable and lovable person in Hollywood. With that being said, it is not uncommon for Cena to be thirsted over or crushed over by female celebrities in the industry. With a gentleman personality and a charismatic personality, Cena sure knows how to knock ladies down. Now, if you are wondering about which celebrities have thirsted over John, say no more, because in this video, we are going to talk about female celebrities thirsting over Cena. So without further ado, let's get right into it. 1. Charlize Theron Stunning beauty and Academy Award-winning actress Charlize Theron was seen crushing over Cena in an interview during the promotion of Fast and Furious 8. She said, John Cena, who couldn't be more lovely? I have such a... He is such an amazing human being. Part of me waiting for the shoot to stop because it is too good to be true. I mean, nobody is that nice, but that's how nice he is. John Cena, who, who couldn't be more lovely. I have such an affinity. Like, he's just, he's an amazing human being. Part of me is like waiting for the shoot to drop because it's almost too good to be true. I was like, nobody's that nice, but that's how nice. It is no secret that many of the top stars in wrestling came from an American football background and Cena is no exception. However, unlike contemporaries such as The Rock and Roman Reigns, football was never the first career choice for him. And as a result, his prolific career in the NCAA Division III is often glossed over or not talked about at all. 2. Leslie Mann Beautiful actress Leslie Mann was seen thirsting over John Cena very badly on The Ellen Show when John was taking her interview. Talking about her nude scene with John, she said that after seeing John naked, she came to realize that is how men should look like his. About this is then I realized like what my husband, like I didn't realize after, before seeing John, you know, without his clothes on, how a man should look. <laughs> While attending Springfield College in his native Massachusetts, Cena worked as a limo driver to help pay the bills. However, his short time driving Lincoln Town cars to and from the Boston Logan International Airport proved not to be a very fruitful endeavor. In fact, Cena would be regularly berated by passengers for showing up two and a half hours late for flights. 3. Nikki Bella Professional wrestler and a stunning beauty. Nikki Bella poured her heart out over John Cena in one of the interviews. She said that John Cena is a freaking magnet to her, and that her heart sinks so deep into her stomach that she doesn't even know how to breathe. I mean, he's like a freaking magnet to me. And it's like my heart sinks so deep into my stomach, like I feel like I don't even know how to breathe. She further said, it's like my lungs are filled with fluid. As if like my lungs are filled with fluid, like it's... For as big of a global superstar as Cena has become, many would be surprised to hear how close WWE came to pulling the plug on the John Cena experiment. Despite having had less than three years of wrestling experience and hardly a year in WWE's developmental territory, Ohio Valley Wrestling, the company quickly promoted Cena to the main roster. From there, Cena had no trouble building momentum, thanks to an electric in-ring debut against Kurt Angel, followed by an on-screen backstage interaction with The Undertaker. 4. Gina Dewan American actress and dancer Gina Dewan was constantly crushing over John Cena on The Ellen Show when he was taking her interview. She said that her boyfriend watches WWE so much that she now is addicted to it and watches John on the WrestleMania all by herself. I mean, okay, but who does that? Something is fishy here. Hey, so Steve, my boyfriend, is a huge wrestling fan, and he got me, like, so into it. So much that I watched WrestleMania, but... After college, Cena moved to California as he wanted to pursue a career in bodybuilding. But with only $500 in his pocket, his dad warned him of running out of money soon. But Cena hustled and worked in a store of Venice Beach's Gold's Gym for $6 an hour to make his ends meet. To save on his expenses, Cena lived out of the back of his Lincoln Continental. I was struggling, but I wasn't ever sad. I was in the place where fitness had become famous, and I actually loved what I did. Today, Cena has worked hard and is now one of the richest WWE superstars. 5. Margot Robbie Emmy Award-winning actress Margot Robbie was also seen crushing over John Cena when she talked about how her teenage boyfriend, who was so obsessed with John Cena, had a life-size cardboard of John and that she slept almost two years with it. 
early 20s, I had a boyfriend who was obsessed with John Cena, so much so <laughs> that he dressed as John Cena for his 21st birthday and had a cardboard cutout of John Cena in his bedroom. So I slept in a room for two years with a life-size cardboard <laughs> cutout. She said that she always wondered whether she will ever work with John or not. I remember thinking, I wonder if now that I'm going to work with John Cena, like, should I tell him this or is that going to be weird? And I thought, I'm just going to keep that to myself. I'm not going to tell him that would be... That with a career spanning over a decade, Cena had several rivalries on WWE, but he considers the one with Dwayne The Rock Johnson as his favorite one. He tends to bring out the best in everyone. That's why I admire him so much. Whether I personally like him or not is irrelevant. He brings out the best in everyone, Cena has told Men's Journal. John Cena and The Rock had faced off against each other at WrestleMania 27 in 2012, in which The Rock emerged victorious. The following year, they had a rematch, where the leader of the C Nation emerged victorious. 6. Show Majazi Famous South African rapper and actress Show Majazi was seen thirsting over John Cena on The Kelly Clarkson Show. Talking about how she wrote her song, she said that she used to pretend to be John Cena and say that you can't see me, and she was just constantly talking about him. So yeah, but I love feel it. it. Yeah. I love it. I love it. And I made this song because it's really like about, you know, because John Cena always used to say, you can't see me. Mm -hmm. So when we used to play wrestling with my cousins, I used to pretend to be John Cena. Cena initially packed his bags and headed out west to pursue a career in acting himself, eventually turning to wrestling after being encouraged to do so by fellow gym goers. Upon arriving in Southern California, he was able to quickly land a job at Gold's Gym in Venice Beach, but wound up homeless just as quickly due to the high cost of living. As a result, Cena resorted to long work shifts before retiring to his new home, a 1991 Lincoln Town Car where he would spend his nights before waking up at the crack of dawn to repeat the process the next day. So guys, this is it for today's video. And if you enjoyed it, then please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon so you never miss a video from our channel.